Hi, I'm Kai Haft. I'm the director of the Making of the Greg Carver Video Show. Welcome to the commentary track. And I am Greg Carver. I am the, the star and the writer and the editor. And we just wanted to do a, uh, a commentary track and tell you behind the scenes basically how it was made. Yeah, because I was, I was honored to come in to direct this episode. This is the only episode I directed. I've wanted to direct another one um, for months now. But th this to me, okay, so to me this is a, this is a video about... Um, about vision, mm -hmm. right? Is yeah, because we're, we're doing a making of, a making of, and so... It's about the glasses that um, you're wearing. That's where you see the essence of this entire episode, maybe the entire series, really, or, or really the character. I don't know if we want to pin the whole series on That's, these glasses. I mean, I you only did direct this one episode, so... But no, but I, to me the glasses, that's the, really the reason why I came on board was because of the glasses. Really? Yeah. I think that you don't... You oh, know. that's Lauren Sweeney. She's, uh, she's well, great. Well, she has nothing to do with the, this at all. She didn't have anything to do with the glasses. In fact, she made me take off the glasses for this makeup thing because she thought that was more realistic. That was actually a point of contention because the glasses represent the inherent uh, obstruction, the, 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 an impermeable membrane, if you will, a, a, a veneer. Uh, the, the, the human soul is unreachable um, when people wear glasses because I don't know what's going on here. This is this is Lauren. The scene where she uh, confronts, where she tells Juan that. Um... Oh, this is when she right. But what's really going on there is she's jealous of your glasses, I think. And she's not. Lauren is great, but she's not a real makeup artist. Uh, what you wanted, what you wanted out of this was clear. You wanted. I I don't really remember. Glasses. I don't remember talking about that. On the day, I think it's an interesting perspective. Uh, this is oh, I love this moment. Oh, I love throwing. This it took us several takes to get that. I think that w what we were really going for there was that you were saying, "Give me my glasses back. I can't see." Damn it! Was that was it was an as if you know the way the actors. I know that you you work with your Meisner technique, right? Um, and I'm, I'm actually not really that familiar with Meisner. But you're not familiar. With I like all of the different schools, though. I think that that, has, that gets really into the character for you. You're saying the character likes all the schools, not you personally. Like you don't, you don't really. No, me, me personally. I don't, I don't know, know what, what the character. No, I think that um, I don't think that what you're saying right now is at all accurate. Even though you're talking about yourself, I think it's wrong. I think that the truth about you is that you you want something in between you and the world. If you look at this, who's wearing glasses and who's not, and who should be wearing glasses and who shouldn't. And I think that that's what's, what really is important to me about this video is that, who, who, am I going to let you see me? Am I going to let you know me? I mean, I Clearly. tend to remember that the people who wore glasses were just the people who showed up wearing glasses on the day. I don't remember no. that. that. That's not the case at all. This was all very carefully crafted, I think, to me. When you sent me the script for this, which was really not very good, but, yeah. but it had a heart to it. And that's what I love about your work is that it has, it has that heart. That, yeah. Well, I wouldn't say heart, but I would say that it has something. Yeah. Right away, actually. I, um, I didn't tell you this before, but as I was reading your script, I was kind of doodling, uh -huh. because I was really not too interested in what, what you were writing there. And afterwards, I looked at what my doodle was, and it was... Do you, do you know was what it, it was? Was it glasses? That, how did you... Yes, it was glasses. Okay, I really think that you're focusing too much on the glasses. And it, well, I think oh, you're focusing wait, too little. Wait. I, I love this part because this, I just love the idea, when I wrote this, I wanted to do the idea of a song that is incredibly depressive, and yet, you know, you No, I think, in, when you came to me with this idea, what you were really, what you wanted to do was you said, can we make a movie that will make people not want to see anymore? Can we make a movie that people will, will or, or put up something, a barrier between themselves and the world. Because that's what glasses are, right? Glasses are... Kai, oh my god, stop talking about glasses, all right? I, I feel like you weren't even making the same movie as me. And it's, it's a hurt. I, I'm starting to realize that now. It seems like you were fixated from the very first moment solely on on spectacles. And, and, and it's just spectacles. ridiculous to get to put spectacles in the way of story. 